Reuters. Bent on sending a strong message to smugglers, Philippine President Gloria Macapagal Arroyo directed customs and anti-smuggling officials to destroy 18 illegal vehicles worth almost 700,000 U.S. dollars. Lost taxes from such cars amounted to about 300,000 U.S. dollars. 10% of around 60,000 vehicles that come to the Philippines each year are said to be smuggled. Whether this act will deter future smuggling, customs officials will have to find out. Among the smuggled cars were a Lincoln Navigator, three BMW X5 SUVs, and a Mitsubishi GTO sports car, now reduced to scrap metal. Finance Chief Margarita Tevez said this robs smugglers of their profits and should discourage them. It serves as a deterrent. We want to make sure that the domestic industry is fairly uh, protected. The, the state can protect itself from injurious acts. And we help to, we help to generate employment and jobs and uh, revenues in the future. Civic groups lobbied to stop the destruction of the smuggled cars, suggesting to auction them instead and donate the proceeds to charity. But customs officials fear that they could end up in the hands of smugglers again. In Subic, I'm Reuters correspondent Michaela Cabrera.